So today we are going to be taking a look at an Amazon exclusive Pokemon collection box. Let's go. <laughs> Right, so down here, down below, let's go down. We have got the Urshifu VMAX Premium Collection. This is the Rapid Strike. Now, this only costs £22. We're going to take a look and see what the pools are like. But if I'm honest, £22 for how many booster packs have we got in here? We have got a lot of booster packs in here. We have got eight Pokemon TCG booster packs. We have got two promo cards and a rapid strike energy reverse hollow card with one of the jumbo cards as well now in my opinion that is the best price of a premium collection box that i've ever seen but i've never bought pokemon cards from amazon before is it going to be worth it well let's open it and find out right so inside this box we have got our three promo cards we've got rapid strike urshifu v which is from battle styles we have got urshifu v max from battle styles as well and then we've also got our rapid strike energy reverse hollow from battle styles now this box is essentially just a juiced up urshifu v max box that released around battle styles since urshifu was essentially the poster boy i guess uh, both versions rapid strike and single strike of battle styles there's your co-card let's go and it's quite interesting that this has been added to amazon you can get each box uh, but this one was on sale at £22. However many dollars is that, I'll put that up on the screen right now. And I don't know if this is available in the US, but it probably is. And we've got eight booster packs. So we've got Darkness of Blaze, Battle Styles, Vivid Voltage, Darkness of Blaze, Vivid Voltage, Darkness of Blaze, Battle Styles, Battle Styles. So we've got no Evolving Skies, no Fusion Strike. It is the older of the Sword and Shield sets, which is cool, which is cool. It's been a while since I've opened, you know, a lot of Vivid Voltage and Darkness of Blaze. But I think we'll start off with Battle Styles as this is what this box is about it's about the battle styles when these are when the normal vmax box boxes came out that is what it was all about so there's your co-card you're welcome i would love to hit something big from battle styles because as i'm sure you know if you um if you've been watching for a while my luck is not that great and if you are new make sure you do like share and subscribe to the channel turn notification bell on and welcome welcome to chef before trading yeah that's right i changed my name guys can you believe it manky reverse hollow and we've got Aegislash slash regular rare so no hits so far now i have a little bit of a funny relationship with um, obviously the exposure on my camera and lighting which I still can't wrap my head around someone help me please and with uh, my yeah I've got a bit of a weird relationship with Amazon so with the global pandemic that happened when we went into lockdown obviously restaurants closed and um, I am a chef you know <laughs> so you can tell by the name and there was no work no work for me there was furlough but um, that was not enough. And we have got an entire hollow. Okay, that's kind of nice. That's kind of sweet. I like that. Very cool. Um, and I had to take work elsewhere. So I ventured off and did a little bit of agency work for Amazon. And I worked in their fulfillment centers. Um, and I tell you what, it wasn't the best. But I did really appreciate being able to get the work and being able to find work so easily with Amazon and because of the global pandemic because there was restrictions on how close you could be with people um, it was difficult it was very difficult to get trained on what we needed we've got a Galarian Slowbo regular rare that is our battle styles we'll move on to Vivid Voltage next because there is a chance there is a small chance that we could get a Charizard VMAX with the Darkness of Blaze. So fingers crossed we can do that. But yeah, it was it was an experience. I think I did it for about, must have been for about two months, that is all. It was night work. Oh, it's the other way around this time. There you go. We can get the Chunky Boy in Vivid Voltage. That would be amazing if we pulled the, reg, uh, the Rainbow Rare. But yeah, it was an experience. There was a, definitely a mix of different people. And after being there for a couple of weeks, you know, you wiggle your way in. Became 
part of the team, if you will, on those long, long night shifts of um, scanning. We've got a Leon Hollow Trainer. Okay, wicked. I like that. I like that. Does that mean we're going to get a Charizard as well? Let's go with the Celebi pack next. Um, and yeah, and ever, ever since, ever since I've why so it's it's different this time as well. As we saw from our last video, the code cards mean absolutely fuck all nowadays because they're all just mixed, aren't they? But um, yeah, it was it was uh, I have fond memories of it: scanning, packing, moving, unloading the lorries. We've got a Jolteon regular rare, no hits so far. We have got four packs left, no three packs left, and they're all darkness ablaze. But it's it's cool to see Amazon get some exclusive um, exclusive boxes. I know that they had the celebrations uh, box where it was the collector's chest plus a couple other things. I think it had the Dragapult binder in there. Fucking that was a waste of money. Them boxes, wasn't it? The Dragapult celebration boxes. Um, Cuffant, Wishy Washy, Rowlet, Skitty, Toxel, Mareep. And let's go. We have got a full art Salamance V. Awesome. Awesome, Paul. Let's fucking go. And that was from a green back. That was from a green back card. So we now know for sure that the code card doesn't matter, does it? And we have got a Salamance V. How's the centering looking? Oh, it's nipped at the top and the centering is way off. But that is a very, very good looking card. I love the colors on that very nice so we've had one hit and it's from darkness ablaze can you believe it it's quite nice old opening these older sword and shield packs now because you know it the, all the hype of brilliant star i still haven't opened that much brilliant star i must um i must get some really i've opened a few a few off camera there's your code card but we've what well, we've done an etb in a build and battle box on the channel um, and I feel like we might need to do more before the hype has gone. Before we get the new set out, which I'm looking forward to. I can't remember the name of it. Um, I'm sure you can let me know in the comments. Dieno, Pansir, Golurk. And we have got a regular rare. Oh, I'm buzzing for that full art. So, last pack. is. Are we going to have last pack magic? <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully, because we didn't get first pack, first pack magic, did we? So maybe we can get the last pack magic. There you go. There's your co-card. It was a white back. So are we going to get anything from this? Maybe, maybe not. It doesn't really make that much of a difference. But yeah, I've always been a bit dubious about ordering Pokemon cards from Amazon. And we have got a Hollow Toxtricity. Oh, wow. Wow. And a reverse Hollow Kabu. Yeah, so ordering Pokemon cards from Amazon because... They are third-party sellers selling through the Amazon shop. I've heard a lot of bad things about them. I haven't really heard a lot of positive things about them. And this is obviously a real product, but I've heard about resealed packs. I've heard about product being fake, um, but still being regular retail price or even more expensive. But it looks like we have hit gold, really. £22 for eight booster packs and a few promo cards. Now... Is it worth opening? I mean, I'd probably, you know, buy it and keep it sealed if I'm honest. That would be the smart thing to do, but I'm not a very smart guy. But anyway, we hit the Salamance V full art. Buzzing for that. We got a few great, great promos. Make sure you check out my other videos. There is loads. As always, I've been Chris. That was Pokemon. Bye.